Hi, everyone. The next section is R programming. We have three topics. The first, loops, the while, repeat, and for loops. And the second topic is if statements. When some condition is satisfied, that we do something else, we do something else. And the third topic is functions. So this is important in R. So we have some ready-made functions in R, such as uh, summation or square root, but we can define any functions we want. Okay, so the first, the loops. The first we study while and repeat loops. Later, we study for loop. And the, suppose that the, we want to find the smallest integer n such that the 2 to the n's power is larger than capital N given a positive integer n, capital N. So how to code? So at first, we think about code for specific n. And the next that we consider code for general n. So this should be a function. So why we want to get this, the lowercase n? Actually, lowercase n is the binary length. So when um, capital N is um, given, then um, lowercase n is the length of the binary expression of this capital N. For example, the um, six in decimal system is 110 in binary system. First digits represent one, second digit um, represent two, and the third digit represents three, uh, four, sorry, um, two square. So six is four plus two, so one, one, zero. And actually the length is three, and that number three is the smallest integer which satisfies this condition, six is less than two to the nth power. So n is equal to three is the smallest number to satisfy this inequality. Okay, so now that we code this for specific n. So suppose the capital N is um, 123,4005, sorry, the uh, 456,789. Then um, to get lowercase n to satisfy that condition, that at first we start with n is equal to one, then we increase n and see if the we the it satisfies that this condition two to the n's power is less than capital n. If it's no longer satisfied, then such n is the smallest integer which satisfies two to the n's power is larger than capital n. And we can use the while loop to do that job. So while two to the n's power is less than or equal to capital N, then we increase the N by one. We define new N by old N plus one. So in that case, the, in this way that we can find the smallest number N, okay? So in this case, the N is equal to 26 satisfies this condition. So N is increased, increased by one. So N becomes 27, but the 27, it no longer satisfies this condition. So R stops there, then returns n is equal to 27. So actually, 2 to the uh, 27th power is this number, 134 million. So this is just slightly larger than capital N. If 26 um, power, then um, suddenly this is smaller than capital N. So this is how to code uh, um, this question. Okay, so another way is to use repeat. They're almost the same thing, but the um, statement is slightly different because the repeat, the re repeat function repeats something until the sum condition is satisfied. So capital N, this is the same as the last page, lowercase n, we start with one, then we increase n by one. Okay, so this the uh, argument comes first. Then if this condition is satisfied, two to the n's power gets larger than capital N, then we stop there, so break. Then it returns N. So the, just the uh, order of these two are different. Um, and the, as long as this, yeah, so the, we stop, 
we stop when this condition is first satisfied. So slightly different, but basically logically the same meaning of the last page. So again, we, we get lowercase n is 27. So this is how to use um, while loop and the repeat loop. 